TOEFL Integrated Speaking Task 5, Listening, Speaking, Casual. You will listen to part of a conversation. You will then be asked a question about it. After you hear the question, you will have 20 seconds to prepare your response and 60 seconds to speak. Answer the question clearly and coherently using information from the conversation. Listen to the passage. On a piece of paper, take notes in the main points of the listening passage. How's your biology class coming along? Terrible. I just took my first test. I didn't do so well. I know how you feel. Sometimes how you do on your test is determined by your study plan. I mean, how you prepare for the test. It's not just about working harder but about working smarter. Well, what do you mean by working smarter? Let me ask you a question. How did you prepare for the test? The night before the test, I studied the chapter and reviewed my lecture notes. Then I asked myself a few questions about what I thought would be on the test and practiced answering them orally and by making written responses. And your study plan didn't work so well, did it? I guess not. You know, I took your same class last semester and I did pretty well thanks to some suggestions given to me by the professor. Really? So how did you prepare for the test? First of all, I took the study guide that the professor gave us and I made note cards with a question on one side and an answer on the other. I reviewed those note cards regularly for about two weeks. Second. I attended the study group led by the teaching assistant of the biology class. And finally, I went to the professor's office and showed him my test preparation notes and asked him if I needed to add additional concepts and terms that would help prepare me for the test. Surprisingly, he gave me some very useful tips. Wow, that's a lot of work. I didn't think the study guide or the study group would be that helpful. But now that you mention it, I think I may just incorporate those two things into a study plan for the next test. And don't forget that you can also meet with a professor who can also help you for the test. After all, he is the one who wrote the test. Good point, but I, I don't really know him very well, and uh, I'm just too scared to meet with him. Anyway, thank you for your helpful suggestions. No problem. Good luck on your next test. How does the woman suggest that the man change his study habits for the next test? Pause the video to record your response.